Within 24 hours of the Hamas attack on Israel, the retaliation had begun. And Gazans awoke to an unrecognisable city. As you see behind me, the whole area become a ghost town. Motaz Aziza documented the unfolding crisis and was quickly caught up in it himself. I just arrived home to take a rest and take a shower. I found out my, my neighbor's house. Got a call from the Israeli military and they told him to they, they are going to bomb the house. It's 5 a.m. in the morning. In sleep. We are waiting for the sun to, to rise up. So we could see what, what happened to the city after a crazy night. Daylight only brings fresh horrors and the rarest glimpses of joy. <laughs> <laughs> but Motaz and half a million other Gazans have no choice but to try to make the perilous journey south any way they can. We are now like crossing the, the bridge. After it, when you cross the steam, it's like the safe area. But in the so-called safe area, there are new threats. Hunger, thirst, sickness. It's, it's an ice cream truck, but you see what's inside? Small kids. Mutaz Aziza is struggling to think about what the days ahead may hold. Lauren Day, ABC News.